<laughs> right, status update. Um, this place, who, I'm sorry, I can't remember who it was that said I had to tidy up during the live stream. It might have been Elliot. Um, but it's gotten worse, right? I know it, it would get worse before it gets better. Um, but there's now gold paint has arrived, which I'll need for spray, spray, spray painting the alloys, which are, hang on, let me show you. So, I've got a stack of um, six or seven alloy wheels outside there. Those are going to have to get painted, so gathering supplies for that. Good news! I have here the carbon fibre resin thing. When you point the camera down, this is great. This is this is uh, this has turned out better than I expected. Let me zoom you in. Now the last lot was tacky. We don't have tacky this time. It's actually dried. But my little trick with the wax has meant that it slides right off. So we're good. So this one is totally solid. <laughs> it's actually it's actually unbendable now. It's absolutely hard. Um, nice and smooth on this side. Nice and carbony. The other side is the side which will be the top of the new part. So I'll need to be able to sand this. Now comparing the two, there's a much better result from the new sheet of carbon fibre. Um, that's both, uh, sorry, that's the two rough sides and that's the two smooth sides so there's a much better result now from using the waxed sheet versus the, the one that kind of stuck to it, you see where it's peeled up. Um, also, bending, so be bending it and it won't, it won't bend. That's why carbon fiber is so cool. So this is this has actually been a really great result. The other thing I'm going to try and do here is give this a quick sand and see how it turns out because it's it's rough to the touch. I I so wish that I could have this smooth surface on the top, but unless I mould the hood scoop, which I can't be bothered doing, I'm going to have to hope that it sands. So let me quickly put the face mask on. Face mask on because remember what I said about carbon dust. I do not want to breathe it. And then I'm going to see how I got on with a quick pass of sand. This is like really rough sandpaper, but let's give it a go. Also, again, god damn it, I need a battery to sand. Tet. That is not going to sand. Absolutely no chance that I'll be able to sand this down. Not unless I use like really fine sandpaper and try and do it almost like I'm polishing. Let me see what fine, if I have any fine sandpaper. I've got 240 grit. 60s. More 60s. Yeah, most of this is rough sandpaper. So I have a limited number of sheets of 240. It's looking like I will not be able to sand the finished product. Yeah, that's not going to work at all because the high spots are just going to burn right through to the cloth underneath. I wish I could get this smooth surface, but I think I'm going to have to live with a rough one. So it looks like uh, we'll have a slightly textured carbon fibre scoop unless I mould it. Maybe what I'm going to have to do here is actually cut it in half and wax it and mould an impression out of it. I think that's what I'm going to have to do. I'm going to have to make a mould, at least for the top section. I'm going to have to mould rather than skinning it. God damn it, this just got a lot more complicated. Well, I suppose it's a good job that we're under quarantine for the next two weeks and can't do anything else because this just got a whole lot more complicated. Uh, Alright, so now I'm going to have to make a mould of the hood scoop in fiberglass and then mould out my carbon 
from that. Which means we might actually be able to do like forged carbon fibre where you cut trimmed pieces and you can press it all together. I don't know, we'll see, we'll, we'll see what we do. Anyway, um, questions, comments in the boxes down below. Let us know what you think. Thank you for watching. I hope everyone's making good decisions. Take care of yourselves and we will see you again in another video. I hope you've been enjoying the more frequent videos, even though some of them have been on odd topics. Look after yourselves, stay safe. We'll see you soon. Bye.